Today I'm going to make a broccoli gypsy style, uh, which means broccoli with a tomato mushroom sauce. What you need is some broccoli, a little bit of lemon, an onion, some mushrooms, a tin of chopped tomatoes, some parsley, some couscous, and a bay leaf if you've got one. And olive oil and salt and pepper, of course. We start off by boiling some water. While the water's boiling, I'm just going to chop the onion. The water's boiled, the onion's been chopped. This is why I'm crying and snivelling. So I'm just going to heat up some olive oil in a large pan and fry the onion for a little while. Now wash and chop the broccoli. I'm going to put that in a pan. with the optional bay leaf, some lemon juice. I'm just squeezing in half the lemon in there. And some salt. So I've just covered it with the boiling water and I'm not gonna put the heat on. I'm just gonna cover it and leave it in there. I've just washed the mushrooms. Now I'm chopping them into thin slices and I'd say you'd need about a large handful per two portions of this dish. I've got about six here, six large ones. I'm using a really large frying pan for this and the onion has been frying in here on its own for about four or five minutes now. I'm gonna add the mushrooms. I'm gonna stir it all in, turn the heat up a little bit, and cover it. And just leave that for a few minutes. It's sizzling away quite a bit now, so I'm just going to turn the heat down again and stir it in, making sure it doesn't burn or anything. Actually, that's browning really nicely. And cover it up again. Right, time to chop the parsley. Again, you want a big handful of parsley per two portions. We're going to chop that up now. Just chopping the leaves of the parsley. We don't want the stalks, they're too hard. And now I'm going to add the salt and pepper as well. I'm using garlic salt, but you can use normal salt if you, if you prefer, or if that's what you've got. This is a great way of eating broccoli. And broccoli is something that we should all be eating a lot more of. I'm just put the couscous in a bowl. So the water's boiled. I'm just going to cover the couscous with the boiling water. There's about half a centimetre on top there. And we just cover that. That's all we do. Couscous is one of the easiest things in the world. I'm going to add the tomatoes to the onions and the mushrooms. Stir that in. I've heard somewhere that chopped tomatoes are better quality of tomato than the whole ones you get in a tin. I can't remember what the reason for it is, but I always buy chopped tomatoes. Now we want to add most of the parsley, just leave a little bit for garnish. And now we can cover it up and leave it to simmer for five minutes while we have some chilled rosé. Drain the broccoli. Which should be cooked but still crunchy. And now we grab a plate. Put some couscous on it. Some broccoli on top of that. We cover the broccoli with the mushroom tomato sauce. Finally, garnish with a bit more fresh parsley. There we have it, broccoli gypsy style.